this video tutorial I will explain simple JDBC insert class and SQL parameter source. Here you can see employee table and it does not contain any rows. We will see using simple JDBC insert and SQL parameter source how to insert one record in this employee table. Here you can see set data source method. Spring container creates a data source object and pass it to this method. That data source object will be set to simple JDBC insert object. Simple JDBC insert object is going to use employee table. In employee table, this employee ID column value will be automatically generated. Here you can see insert method which accept employee object. Here I am converting employee object to SQL parameter source object. Then I am calling execute and return key method of simple JDBC insert object and passing SQL parameter source object. This method insert one record in employee table and returns the auto generated key. Here I have defined the class employee. It has four properties employee ID, name, age, and salary. Here I have defined the interface employee DAO. It has one abstract method. Method is insert, which accepts employee object. Here I have defined the class employee DAO impl which implements employee DAO interface and provide implementation of insert method. This is a spring configuration XML. Spring container read this XML and it creates a data source object. To create data source object, spring container needs to know driver class name, URL of the database, username and password of the database. Once a data source object is created, it is injected to employee DAO impl. Here I have defined the class app. Here I have created application context object by reading a spring configuration file. Using getbin method of application context object, getting employee DAO object from a spring container. Then I am calling insert method of employee DAO object and passing the employee object. This method insert one record in employee table. Here you can see one record is inserted successfully in employee table. You can get Java source code link for each video in the description section of the video. Here you can see the description section. Click on show more. And here you can see the Java source code links. Click on these links to get the Java source code. 